Well, good evening. It is now my fine pleasure to introduce you to one of our special guests this evening, uh, Deputy Lord Lieutenant of the West Midlands, Les Ratcliffe. Thank you very much for joining us tonight. My pleasure. <laughs> Looking lovely. Is this the first time you've got the suit out in 18 months? It is actually. Is it? 19 yeah. <laughs> months. We, we, I think it was New Year's Eve 2020, yeah, I think. So, uh, yes. Wow, that's crazy. Yes. You dusted off the medals. Dusted off. Yeah. Yes, yes. Well, you're looking lovely. I yes. mean, you've had an illustrious career within the armed forces and then the reserves and then as a veteran. Can you just give us a quick summary of that? Well, I'd be here all night. But, uh, <laughs> in a sentence? But, can you do but, it in a sentence but, or two? Very busy, yes. Yeah. Uh, well, I think the main thing for me, I, I joined the army at a, a very young age mm -hmm. as a boy soldier. Yeah. Uh, and then after six years left and uh, went uh, went into business. Yeah. Uh, but I carried on my military experience with the reserves. Yeah. And in line with uh, what I'd learnt in the regulars, I transferred that knowledge mm. into business. Uh, and then obviously uh, produced, uh, carried on. Yeah. Uh, with my reserve uh, uh, activities with the reserve forces. Absolutely, and we're going to shine a light on some of those positives as yes. you know when people leave the armed forces and go uh, or transition in, into yes. into veteran civvy life, as we like yes. to say. Um, Philip, tell us why you believe that these awards are so important and shining a light on a community. I, I really believe in awards like this because there are times when uh, in someone's life that they need that shining light put on them. Yeah. Um, there's lots of experience uh, uh, which is uh, taken up whether in regular service or mm -hmm. reserves and it's great to see that transferred either into the community or into business life if they transition from regular service. So I think this is a great opportunity to yeah. uh, really say thank you in a lot of mm. cases but also to reward people yeah. for the type of work they've done. Absolutely and uh, what are you looking forward to most this evening? I'm going to look forward to the stories, to be true. Yeah, they're very inspiring, yes, aren't they? Uh, from all over England, yeah. uh, there's all different types of regiments, mm -hmm. um, uh, Royal Navy, uh, Air yeah. Force, so straight across the military spectrum. And I'm really interested in seeing some of those uh, exciting achievements. Absolutely. There's going to be lots of tears, hopefully. And we love a tear. We love a tear, Jim. Yes, <laughs> yes, I'm sure there will be. And you'll be clapping your hands as well a lot. Lots of surprises. Yeah. <laughs> Well, look, thank you so much for joining us this evening. Uh, Les Ratcliffe, ladies and gents. Thank you.